All right, moving on to your relationship and marriage lines. That area just above the flirt lines, just below the bottom ring of that mercury or that little finger, are your relationships and your marriages. These horizontal lines sit between the top of the heart line and the bottom of the ring on that little finger. There's a timeline there, and you divide these up into three sections. Now coming up from the bottom, that first section is your 20s and 30s, the middle section is your 40s and 50s, and that third section is 60 and above. You'll read those lines beginning from the back of the hand, which is the start of the relationship or the marriage, towards the palm, which is later on. The lighter lines will be relationship lines, and the darker ones, the more prominent lines, will stand out and have a great density and color to them, reflect your marriages. Now as we take a look at those horizontal lines on the edge of your right hand, and we can see a couple of little relationship lines. They kind of show up there. And then you have a little longer term relationship. We can see that. But then you've got this very strong marriage line. And that's sitting about the time frame that it is now. So this looks like your current relationship. And it's a good marriage line. Now it does have a little bit of an overlapping line. And what that means is... uh physical separation. Now that's nothing bad, that just means that maybe uh, somebody else is working in a different city, military service or something like that, but there's kind of a physical separation. But it's a good deep line with some good color. Then you've got another little tiny relationship all the way up there in your late 70s. But it's a very strong marriage line. Now the children lines come down vertically from the bottom of that ring around the mercury finger and you count them from the inside of your palm to the outer edge. And these can be biological children, stepchildren, adopted, godchildren, or nieces and nephews. Any child that you build a strong bond with. Now as we take a look at those vertical lines and they sprout right just off the bottom of the ring of that pinky finger on the right hand. And you've actually got four children lines there. And they're really robust lines too. It means you'll have a good bond with those children. And then you got a little gap, and then there's a bunch of little lines behind that. Those are grandchildren lines. We don't usually count those in your hand. Those are better counted in your children's hands. But you've got uh, four very robust children lines.